everyone. Hi. Hello. And welcome once again to our online prayer. We are so glad to have Colleen joining us today. Yes, what a treat. And so, folks, today we're going to do something a little different. And we have our church directory. And we are going to take the time to pray for our church family from this directory. Each member of our church family is precious, mm -hmm. and we're going to lift them up today in prayer. But first, Colin, you have something to share. I do. Continue earnestly in prayer. Colossians 4, 2. And isn't that the way we are to be? Continue to pray without ceasing. And that's what the opportunity that we have every week online to pray for one another. And we thank the Lord for Melody and for Brian for their consistency. And we join together in our hearts. And we ask you to join with us yes, in belief for God to touch and to heal and to do many things in the life of our church family. Praise the Lord. Amen. So folks, join with us in prayer. We are so grateful, Father God, for Heritage Valley yes. Pentecostal Assembly. Father, what a wonderful church family we have, and we are so blessed to be part of it. And today, Father, we I just lift up and bring to you our pastoral team of Pastor Larry, Pastor Philip, Pastor Matthew, and the support staff of Janice and Ruth. Father, thank you for these wonderful people and the work they do. And Father, I pray and I lift up our pastors before you, Father God, that because so often the pastors carry the, the big load, mm -hmm. but you're there to give them strength, to help them, to carry them through, and to be with them, Father, and give them wisdom, guidance, and direction of the Holy Spirit. We thank you for our pastor's counsel that give wisdom and direction and leadership for Pastor Larry, for Gary and Marlene, for Harold and Janet, for Janice, Donna, Doug, and Colleen. Father, thank you for this group of people who monthly meet together to lead and guide and direct and give leadership to our church in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father God. We thank you for the unity that is there. We thank you, Father God, for the heart of these people, of the, each member of the council, Father. Thank you that they love you, they care for you, they want to serve, and they are serving you here at HVPA. And for the elders, for Pastor Larry, for Phil, for Bob, for Harold, and for myself, Father, we, and our wives, our spouses, thank you, Father God, that we are able to be a part of the leadership and and thank you father god that as situations arise that we need to serve that we can step in and with the leadership and the guidance of the holy spirit deal with uh things that may may arise and we are so glad to be um part of that uh, leadership we thank you for each elder we thank you for the roles that we each play father just bless each one father for the finance team of Pastor Larry, John, Marilyn, Donna, Gary, Doug, and Donna. We, Father, we pray, Lord, that there are times that decisions have to be made. And, Father, we are, we are commanded in Scripture to be good stewards of that which you give us. And, Father, you have blessed Heritage Valley Pentecost Assembly in so many ways. And thank you, Father God, for a team of people that are there to give leadership and direction as to how we deal with the finances and how we use the finances to further the kingdom of Jesus Christ here in Edmonton. We thank you for the Women's Council of Marilyn, Colleen, Diane, Sheila, Heather, Cheryl, Jennifer, and Jill. Father, thank you for the women of this church and the mm -hmm. ministry that they are doing actively monthly on a regular basis we thank you for them and father may you be with each member of that council as they make decisions as they choose the and they they choose the direction that the women's council the women's group will go 
We thank you for that and bless each one, we pray, in the name of Jesus. Father, for the men's team of Pastor Larry, Gordon, myself, and Harold, Father, thank you that we have a men's group that meets on a regular basis. And thank you for the opportunity to study your word and to pray and to support one another. And may we as leaders just continue to seek your face and seek your wisdom. For the missions team of Pastor Larry, Marlene, Pastor Matthew, Donna, and Cheryl, Father, thank you that this is a church that believes in missions. And we support missions. And thank you, Father God, for the leadership that each member of that team gives in the direction we go. And for the prayer team, Father God, for Ruth, Margaret, Marlene, Jennifer, Mary, myself and Melody, Jamie, uh, David and Ardell, Jan, Randy and Cheryl, and Diane. Father God, we are a church that prays, and mm -hmm. prayer is so important. And we are told to pray without ceasing. Yes. And thank you, Father God, for each member of this team. Father God, they're behind the scenes. They're not seen weekly. But they're behind the scenes and they are such a vital part, a vital support of this prayer ministry. And we thank you for each one and their willingness to pray, their willingness to support the body of Christ in prayer. And finally, Father, for the Futures Committee of Pastor Larry, Brian, Harold, Janet, Jeff, and Diane, Father God, Lord, we thank you for this team that, Father God, is looking ahead. Mm -hmm. What's in store for Heritage Valley Pentecostal Assembly? And we thank you for their wisdom. Give them guidance, direction. We pray, Father, in Jesus' name. And we thank you for that. And Father, we pray that you just cover each individual in leadership with your Holy Spirit and, and with your um, strength. Because everybody needs strength to do the work of the ministry. And Father, we pray for that, for everyone in leadership, in any church, yes. that you would just be with them. Jesus. And may they feel your Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. We praise you, Lord Jesus, for each one that is either an attendee, on site, or online. Lord, there is a number of names, and we will just quickly go through them because you know them you know them yes, by name Lord, hallelujah. but we bring them to you and we may even miss names because people have joined us but we pray for Kimmy for Donna for Marilyn for Bert and Clarice for Donna for Don and Paulette for for Leanne and her husband and family we pray for Phil Diane and Elaine we ask that you would be with Brian and Melody. We pray for Gunther and Joyce. We pray that you would be with Grant and for Marcy and for Joy, for Bill and Margaret, for Gordon, Sheila, Holly and Zoe. We pray for Adam and Summer and for their children. We pray for Dorothy. We pray for Bob and Donna. We pray for Greg and Elaine. We pray for Daniel and Vanessa. We pray for Diane, for Frida. We pray for Harold and Janet, for Gavin, for Joshua, for Alice, for Vi, for Glenn and Jan, for John and Jeanette, for Pastor Bob and Karen, for Linda, for, for Rudy and Inga, for Joy, for Joe and Letissa and their family, for Gwen, for Inez, for Alina and her husband. We pray for Jeff and Janice and their family. We pray for Jennifer, for Al and Betty, for Diane, for John and Sharon, who are at Heimdall. We pray for Renee, for Brian Corthius. We pray for Brian Ruth, we pray for David, for Brian, for Ed and Helen, for Earl and Jane, for Larry and Colleen, Lance and Summer, for Sue. We pray for Greg, we pray for Barb, we pray for Lauren and Donna, we pray for Sandy, 
We pray for Ed and Luella. We pray for Fred, Frida. We pray for Donna, Don and Shirley. We pray for Pastor Philip and Jill. We ask that you would be with Susan, Brody and Marilyn. We ask for continued guidance with Ruth and Irwin and healing touch for Ruth. We pray for Jerry and for Gord. We pray for Charlene, for Don, Doug and Ruth, for Pastor Matthew and Becca, for Florence. We pray for David, Pastor, for uh, David and Ardell, for Sunelda, for Gary and Marlene, for Dean and Teresa, for Cindy, for John and Sharon, for Grant and Linda, for Lily and Leonard, for Adolf and uh, Lydia, for Esther and her girls and family. We pray for Doug and Heather and their family, for Randy and Cheryl, for Peter and Margaret. We ask that you would be with Chris, for Elizabeth, for Ken and Annette, for Heather and William, for Jack and Dorothy, for Doug and Hat Kathy, for Jamie, for Victor and Elizabeth, and for Marie and, and her family, for Ashley and Nancy, for Wilbur, Donna and, and Paul. In the name of Jesus, yes. we pray a covering on oh, each yes. and every family. Yes, Lord Jesus, yes. you know that we have missed names, but you know them yes. as we have prayed already. Thank you, Jesus, for this body of believers, and we support them in prayer today. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Well, folks, thank you, each and every one, who uh, uh, you are part of a Church Family Heritage Valley Pentecostal Assembly. You are loved, you are appreciated, you are wonderful, mm -hmm. and we thank you for being who you are and what you bring to this church family. God bless each and every one of you, and have a wonderful week, and we trust we will see you back here next Wednesday. God bless you, folks. Okay.